Olympic Park. I mean, this is where the best aerial ski jumpers come from, like all over the world to practice. I'm going to try to get on some of these ramps and uh, see if I can do some aerial stunts myself. Hi, hey, man, nice to meet you. Is there anything special about these skis that make them good for jumping, except for the fact you've got babes on them? Uh, that's a good reason. Um, <laughs> no, they're just normal skis. Okay, so, all I gotta do is go down there, hit that jump. Look at all these people watching me. That last jump was not a perfect execution. I'm just, I'm just gonna look like I know what I'm doing. Hopefully. Yeah. Day one, I think we got lucky with the weather. I mean, it was nice and sunny yesterday. That might have been the end of our good luck. Looks like we're bound to have some pretty bad rain and possibly snow for the rest of the week. No matter the weather, you have to do the same thing that you do normally. Don't shy away from it just because it's adversity. Yeah, dude! <laughs> Fortunately, I have an opportunity here to meet with Ashley Caldwell, who is a two-time Olympian and a freestyle world champion. My yeah. goal is to be Olympic champion. I, like you're 60 feet in the air and you're flipping around with skis, like it feels yeah. sweet. So what do you want to do today? You want to do more 360s? You want to actually try your backflip today? Do some front flips? Like, I think I would like to try a backflip. Today? Okay, let's do it. 
That's what I want to do. You can do that. You might land on your head. You're, you'll likely land on your head. Chances are good that he lands on his head. Those are the chances. <laughs> Trying on my new wetsuit. What do you think? And it took me two and a half hours to put it on. Going down, up, and then. Good. We're here at the ski team gym, and uh, we've got a sweet bungee system here that will get you on a belt, and it's a really safe place for you to try try double backflips. I feel like like I'm a car in the shop right now, just getting work done. I just had an awesome recovery workout session and I'm feeling like feeling a little bit better right now. Some of the soreness is out. I'm, uh, it's a beautiful day right now. Uh, it looks like it's 64 degrees. I wish I were doing some jumps right now. So, time to try out the high, high ramp. <sighs> no, no, no. I don't trust this ramp one bit. Shit. <laughs> now, like a minute ago, I was like, let's do the single, come on, let's do it, I'm ready. Now I look at that thing and I'm like, that's twice as much ramp. Now I feel my pulse. All right. So, with the extra little, like, whatever foot, he wasn't patient enough, and so when he got to the ramp, his ski, his edges dug in, and so he got off balance, and then... A didn't, lot went wrong there. Yeah, didn't get the set. A lot went wrong. Ah, training's not so strong, I either to take a break. jump today, I might be able to land a double. If this was just middle of training, I could go out here and I could take some jumps, and if I didn't land it, there would always be tomorrow. But tomorrow, I'm on a plane home, so it's got to be today. Nice, confident takeoff. This, this medal of, oh of, of, of excellence so and excitement and wow, I got the gold. Everything that you've done this week, I just, I'm just super proud of you. I'm a gold medalist. Woo! I don't think you could have asked for anything more out of this. I'm just hoping that uh, for the next adventure we pick something a little warmer. What I know.